Lil B, fuck em up, Lil B, fuck em up What's up, man? Welcome back to another episode of the Coaching Carousel series. And in today's episode, we have the BGSU Falcons on the schedule. No, this is not the same team from the BGSU series, but it's still the same old Falcons, baby. We're going to see a lot of familiar faces, a lot of names that y'all will recognize from the early part of the BGSU series, but not all the guys will be there. And we have two ends. On one end, we got BGSU, one of the worst teams in college football. And on the other end, we have number 20 Wyoming facing one of the worst teams in college football in Bowling Green. But if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, that way you'll be notified the next time I drop a video just like this one. Also slide in that comment section, talk to your boy. We talk back over here. And if you don't believe me, just say something and watch what happens. You dig what I'm saying? But I'm about ready to hop into this game and see what these Falcons look like on the field. Let's get into it. All right, let's take a look at the team stats. We'll look at the Falcons as their offense is not that great. It really isn't. And their defense is well below average. I would say that their defense is one of the worst in the country. Now, our offense is okay in certain areas. Points is okay. Yards is okay. Passing yards is not that great but we are number one as far as rushing and on the defensive side our defense is not that much better than bowling green's defense so i expect both teams to score points in this game and that's all i'll say about that we do have the running back slash quarterback slash receiver slash halfback slash defensive back steven rogers scheduled to visit today so hopefully he'll have a good visit and we'll get him to lock in his commit to the cowboys and that will change our program if we get them top players for your cowboys we have the middle linebacker easton gibbs we got an 87 overall kicker and we got an 81 overall defensive tackle and from the bgsu falcons we do have a couple familiar faces we got carl with the k you can get sacked on any play on any day or night get it right and then we have the tight end christian sims and we have a wide receiver that i do not remember yeah i don't i don't remember that guy Glad to have you with us da, in the studio. Da, I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports da, da, NCAA da, da, Football 14 pregame show da, 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 presented by Visa. Innovation. It's time for some the more Wyoming Cowboys action against the Falcons. Knees to defend its home turf. And that Ain't no birds flying today. The it's Larry. the Cowboys. That does it for us here on the We shoot them down. Show. You know what I'm saying? We'll see you at the hat. Yeah. 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 You know it's time for the Cowboys. Bitch. I need the crowd to make a lot of noise so we can run the score up. Oh, yeah. We don't give a fire. The Falcons know what's up. Hey, yeah. Get hit with a Mack truck. Yeah. Number 20. Make sure you put the 20 in front of Wyoming. And War Memorial Stadium. Alright, time to see what these Falcons got. Nice run there. Send that heat. Send that heat. And I missed. And there's another missed tackle. And he might be gone. Yep, he might be gone. 
Okay, okay we get a tackle, finally. Play, the right call, good oh, my God! Run Jason Patterson down. is petting my DBs on top of the helmet. Bring him down. Run up the middle. Man got 48 yards already. And there's Tay Keith and getting the first down. At the 18. And that was an excellent There's a familiar there. face. Yeah, Bitch. The tailback. And there's another missed tackle. But we did. Well, that's not a TFL, but we'll take it. And we got Big Mac. Tries to get around the and he's corner. scrambling. No. Nope. And there's a broken tackle touchdown. Bowling Green. Bowling well, got a guy that statistically if you hear from day one, right now, you will remember Big Mac. All right, we got Purdue upset number ten Notre, Notre Dame, twenty to thirteen. Right to be upset. Oh boy, up the upsets are already piling on early in the season. Notre Dame is one and two. In another game. You will argue they don't year, deserve the to be in the top 10. Right. And then we got number 24, Iowa, Iowa losing to Iowa State. In and number 18, Wake Forest loses State. to they ULM. The Cyclones take it by Everybody six. losing. And off the tightest. And you get stuffed you know, in the backfield. Back. Try to screen. And just they just get stuffed in the backfield as well. Not a good start to the game. Two plays, and we, we went backwards twice. Ain't no way we about to lose to the BGSU Falcons. I will not be able to explain that to my subscribers. <laughs> and we got a catch from Alex Brown, and he gets the first down. Let go, my boy. Make sure he had enough yardage to pick up the first down. All right, run a little read option. Up the middle. Now they get us four. A four yard gain by the halfback on the option. Let's try this triple option. Now they get us a first down. Andrew Peasley. Pitch it to Titus. And he cannot outrun that guy. And that's called with the K on the play. Read option again. And we get the first down again. Andrew Peasley with 10. I see they're going single high safety now. We might be able to expose that later on in the game. But right now, we're going to go with this option. Let's see if we can sneak in this screen pass. Okay, we got a block. At least get a first down. Joey. Oh no! Even I barely got that off. Pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. <laughs> okay. Takes it up the the CPU missed the tackle, and, tackle and, and we'll take it. He did not get uh, to the first down marker. We going for like it. He might pick up ahead of steam. Eight speed stretch. Don't fail me now. We got to get a first down because we don't want to kick a field goal on this part of the field. It's the tailback. He's knocked out. There's a first down. About the five yard line. Titus. Try to run him up the middle. He's taken down. And the we five. get denied. And that was Brock Horn on the tackle. Y'all guys might remember Brock Horn. Brock let the horn blow, but I'm about to. Down he goes. Right, I thought it was about to score. <laughs> and that will be the end of the first quarter. We do have a seven point deficit, but we are knocking on the door. And I like our chances to get through the door, whether the Falcons want us to or not. Can we get in there? Yes, sir. Andrew Peasley. With the TD. I think the option down by the goal line is a big great six. Bringing so in six. All right, Falcons, what you got? 
and we have a little trickery going on here, and they get a first down. And we got the Falcon dancing. And we got Big Mac dropping back, and it's picked out by Easton Gibbs. The start linebacker. Would it be a pick six? No, you're going to get tripped up. But we will take it, though. Getting the turnover. But Easton, smart throw from baiting him into throwing it, like right to him. Saw the linebacker hanging in that area. It he said, "I'll take that." Right spot at the right time. He almost made it home. Try to run up the middle. He carries the ball for a nice game. We get four. To the left, to the left, run that HB stretch to the left. They can't stop the it. Shot. Nobody Let's can. Titus running in on the HB stretch again. This kid is a really reliable. Y'all know what the deal is, man. All right, we picked out Big Mac last time. What are you going to do now? You're going to hand it off. And my guy got ran over. Dear God. CTE on deck. Let's send some heat at this boy. Can you stand the heat? And he can't. Big Mac gets put on the grill like a burger. Got. He's hanging out back there a long time, and there's a wide open guy in the middle of the field. He wanted to go deep. We had that covered. Can't get him. That's a nice tackle, though. Another run. Take Keith. Running over my DBs and linebackers. Will they run it? Probably will. Now it's a pass. And it's completed right across the middle. Christian Sims. Hey, bring him down. There's a run up the middle. Can we get out the field? He's in trouble. He's scrambling. Bring him down. And he drops it. <laughs> Second, he Does he have enough leg? He probably do. He gets it up and it's long enough, and he just yep. drilled it from long range. Barely, but it was enough. This one off. Yeah. Grant. from the five, across the thirty. Can he run it back? Can he run it back? He ain't run it back. It's Tyrese! Tyrese! Touchdown! Give him a kick six! He did a great job setting up blocks and then used some great field sets. Oh man! Once that happened, swerve on him! Oh my god! Okay, we got a speed option. Give me a tackle! The halfback just couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage. We hit hard out there. You know what I'm saying? Okay, we got a pass. And he's open. And, he's and that's Tyrone. The you better call Tyrone and tell him what Big you need. I said, Tyrone, I need you to stop catching them FDs. They tried to get a and there's a false start there. on the offense. False start offense. Bag it up, Maybe he got the you big dumb birds. Play action. And he throws it out of bounds. And he just gets rid of it. Big Mac dropping back again across the middle. First down. Oh, the receiver. Tackle made right around across the, the middle. Across Good the middle. The across the middle. First down. First down. First down. Right way to catch a pass. To go. Well, if it's always Ball going across the middle, why don't you get in the middle? It ain't that simple. <laughs> Play action. Because as pressure. you can see. They go right across the middle. Even when I'm in the middle. <laughs> Bruh, I can't make this up. Okay. And he broke the tackle. Broke another tackle. Nice run there. Bruh. He calls his own number and gets about six yards. Send them boys in there. Let me send them boys in there. Send them boys in there. That's a TFL. 
That's a screen. No, sir. You got to kick a field goal. You can't count on Tyrone. Field goal. This ain't nothing but a chip shot. Should be right down the middle. One possession game with this kick right here. Unless they shank it. It's right down the middle. And it's good. A quick update now. Here's Reese. Down, down. Take a look at the and we got and number four five. Texas A&M leading number one Alabama three to zero Texas all right we got a minute and 35 can we run our offense and get down the field get over here and I should have kept it as the quarterback. You know, sometimes the defense just has a beat on an option and, and there's Bryce brand Okay. Now he's I don't see nothing. I don't see nothing. Under pressure. And we only get six. And, and that ain't gonna do here. it. Have I do not want to get the ball back with a minute left, or a little less than a minute. Need to get this first down. And he drops it. Really ain't got a choice. We got to punt it here. We do not want to get them good field position if we don't convert. Yeah. Signals for a fair catch. The Falcons quarterback, Kirk, he has done his job. Unfortunately, there's 22 guys on a team, and one guy's doing a great job. The other 21 aren't so much. And we'll see if they can can we stop Big Mac? Quarterback stats are one thing. Winning the game. Here we got Kavon Kroom. Quick out to his receiver. The football. Get to him. Oh my God, man! Open field tackle. Throws it deep. And look, got burnt. Fires in there, got it. Touchdown. And now they calling on Tyrone. You better call Tyrone and tell him what you need. I said Tyrone, stop catching them TDs, my boy. Oh, they trying to get a little, trying to get a little risky here, going for two. We come for you, my boy. We coming for you, you. Big Mac. Yeah. Got to try to push it down the field. Uh, and trading, what you doing, bro? Uh, man, tiptoeing like he about to go out of bounds, bro. You ain't nowhere near the out of bounds line, bro. Anyway, really don't have that much time. Got to bounce. I see you. He throws Joshua right. Cobbs. The, ten. the best the receiver on the team. Let's run it. Get in there. Titus. Swing. Getting it in. He's got two touchdowns on the ground today. Let's go for two. Is up by eight. And go up by ten. HD stretch to the left. Run that HD stretch to the left. All we got to do is hold for three seconds. Surely we can do that. It already seems like we're going down. And that will be the end of the first half. And we got a 10 point lead. We've still got a half of football remaining. The Cowboys with a 10 point lead. We played 30 minutes. I'm Glad starting to, to like my chances right now. Sports NCAA football I really am. Halftime show presented by the Falcons Nissan. aren't going away quietly. That excites. I don't expect them to. to Big Mac everything that just is a good quarterback. When you don't give up we all attacks, know that. Neither team dead in the first half. The offensive line gets a lot but of credit. And deservedly so. The Cowboys the are just a little get rid of the football bit on better. Yep. Throw it away when they need to. But a lot of times they're no doing disrespect. It because they don't really feel but we are. from the defense. Yeah, and, and defensively, you got to be able to see that. And if it's a three-step drop, then all you can do is get your hands up, try to deflect footballs. And if you're in the, in the, if you're in the middle see. of the defensive tackle, we don't have a whole lot of yards. You can. So when that quarterback we did have the kick up, six. Have step into somebody. Or how about you make them move? And they get have way more yards than us. They done Especially almost the doubled side. us in both categories. Talk about that guy. Passing and rushing. All the money. A lot of times but we do edge them out in a time of position, pass rush and we don't have a turnover. The quarterback can't see. Hopefully, so some way, shape, I didn't just jinx sure that they the team. And get some pressure on them. Just about time I can't remember if we turn it over or not at the end of this game. But anyway, this is post commentary, so I should know the end, but actually, I don't remember. 
Let's see. He scrambled. Oh, I see him. He goes He's open. He got Alex Brown. Way downtown. Getting them first downs. Whenever he comes around. Oh, yeah. Right, let's try to toss again. And he did not get blocked. They make the stop at the 27. And there's to get the ball a loss. On the, outside on the, sweep. the offensive line couldn't get enough lateral movement to keep the defense from stopping him for a loss. Oh, let's try to screen this time. At least we got two yards instead of losing two yards this time. Come on, Joshua. Got to get some going downfield. He's uh, that's a touchdown. Trayton Welch. All in the end zone. Wow. How about that? Big 81. Big payoff. the offensive coordinator is one of the Yes, sir. And number one, Alabama is now leading Texas AM. 7-3. Still early in the game. And for Gibbs, he barreled into the end zone for a touchdown. The Crimson Tide on top. 7-3. Late in the first quarter. Let's go, defense. He's on the run. Get him. Now get him down. Get back to the line of scrimmage on that scramble. Good job by the junior line. Hit him with his stick. And limit the play to a short. Okay, we got a run. Run down after a nice run. Get seven. And right across the middle. First down. The 48-yard line. They're running a toss play. He's at the 40. And, and they get the first down. At the 36. Come on, defense. No. Across the middle. Broken tackle. Right around the 26 yard line. 10 yards later. Get him in the backfield. On the draw. And he, oh, he my God. Oh, hell no. Oh, ah. This man was stuffed in the backfield. But no. No, I don't want to attack you. I'm going to let you go. He's got the moves, the speed, the power. I think you deserve a touchdown. Can we get some on the return? And he shoved out of bounds. And we got a flag. Flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. Receiving team. Free haircuts. Son of a bitch. They're allowing the offense to kind of dictate Try to screen. To and one thing is that any defense uh, defense, you have to be the one trying get to eight. take things. Oh, you should get it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's at midfield. Oh, yeah. He goes down. Andrew Peasley. Getting them first downs. Okay. Okay, Titus. What we got? Okay, Triton. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He's tackled at the four-yard line. Andrew on the ground. Okay. There it is. Touchdown. Alex Brown. Bring it around down. Tremendous example of the type of chemistry. Number nine is doing fine. Enjoy. When a quarterback and a receiver are on the same page, this defense figures out how to stop it. What you got, Big Mac? Have no problem moving the ball. Throws it out of bounds. Just throws this one away. That's the one. He running. He going down. Big Mac. Where you going, my boy? Third and fourteen. He wants it all. He's going deep. Time. Before he can go anywhere. Bruh. Where do the DBs be going, man? Holy shit! You come on, bruh. There's a screen. Get over there. <gasps> and he missed the tackle. Down he goes at about the 29 yard line. Big Mac got 230 yards passing. 
I don't know if he ever had 230 yards passing when we had him. Oh my God. Nice run there. Keith gains about four that yards. That man is running court. like. And there's another pass. He's taken down at the two yard line. They're about to score a touchdown, bro. Big Mac good. is lighting us up. Fuck! What? Damn it! There's another pass. And there's a touchdown. But he went out of bounds first. Ready to quit just yet. And some of the players yep. are illegal touching. We have a penalty on the play. They run it this time. And I ran right past him. And there's a touchdown. God damn it. So it doesn't even matter. They score anyway. The nation's elite team in the top five. This is a game we've been watching closely all day long. The Crimson Tides unleashed and Alabama and is still leading Texas A&M 14-3 in the second 14. quarter now. Green from the six. What we got? He's out to the what 30. we got? What we got? Pushed out of bounds. Around the four. Tyrese. The Cowboys had that hot hand on. Turn on the speed. Keep on going here in quarter number three. Hey, little option. We're not going to run down. away from him. The -yard line. He keeps it and picks up. And that will be the end of the third quarter. I'm gonna need everybody to put their foes up. This is a ten-point game. This one's a little tighter. Defense can't get a stop. Offense is okay. Option Titus and he's first the down. Let's see what we got. There he is. Trading, breaking the tackle. He's going in for a touchdown. Let's go. And Andrew is looking good through the air so far today. Oh my god, he's on X Games for the home run. Trading, making a play. Bringing the tackle. Can't lock me down. No shackles. Okay. Got a screen. Can't get over there. And there he goes. He's at midfield. Well, we might catch him. Tackle at the 24. Oh my. I can't believe I'm getting murdered on screen passes today. That usually doesn't happen. And Big Mac is over 300 yards now. Another time, bring it down. He just blew past the block. He's running right into the sack. Boy, excellent play by the defense. Like, here, sack me. Seconds and those receivers Don't you want to sack open. me? I'm right here. Please hit me. And there's the open guy, Jalen Embry. I know y'all remember him. There's a run. And he's going to carry him into the touchdown. Take Keith. It's showing off. Can't tackle him like we mosquitoes and he sprayed off. And only one yard. A little triple option. Andrew Peasley. Gains his way to the 43 yard line. Right, sticking with the option. Slide. Slide. And what are they calling? Watch it be clipping. Offense. Going back with the read option, and there's a face mask. They ain't gonna call it though. Okay, Titus. Oh, selfish play by the quarterback is the option. Damn, Titus. Game. Are you okay? More option. He's at the forty. Right down. More the first downs yards. from Andrew Beasley. Pick up another first down. He's on the run, and he hits him hard. Okay. Twenty-seven. Got a screen. He's taken down at the and that gives exactly one yard. Let's see 
Let's try a little HB again. stretch. We get a block. Inside the ten. Come back in. Touchdown, Titus. Let go. It's big A. Ain't nobody the safe. The head coach of this football team. Put the defense on skates. Skate. What you're doing and how to attack the defense. And right now, these but you got Big Mac. Out of bounds. Another pass, and he completed that. Oh, my God. Now they're going to hurry up. Yeah, he's running. He's tackling at the 48. The screen, and we finally shut that screen down. Straight 39. Keep him away from the first down, and we do. They probably gonna go for it though, and they are going for it, just like I thought. Can we get a stop? Okay, no, we cannot get a stop because we cannot defend the corner out. Another pass. Incomplete. Okay. What you gonna do, Big Mac? And you're gonna find a wide over <laughs> wide open receiver. Touchdown, Christian Sims. This man is gonna have 400 yards passing before the game is over with. They're gonna try the onside kick. And we're gonna get it. All right. We getting out game on <laughs> like we getting out game, but we winning the game. He's at the four. And there's Titus. The the Going down the sideline. Touchdown. All he needed was one play. Well, and he scored a, another touchdown to today. He running like Forrest. No gump. All right. Pretty much got this game in hand. Don't want to allow another score, though. And he's going deep. And that should have been picked off. Takes the ball inside. Nice run there. All right. They're going to hurry up. There's another short pass, and there's a fumble, and we got it. I think it was out too. They work hard, and they got clearly out. Well, we know it was out. Defense taking advantage, but it was out before he went down. Oh yeah, let it go. He's taken down. Just gonna run it. Try to run the clock out. Probably could take a knee. He's at the thirty. He gets hit out of bounds. At about that ain't going to run the clock out. Line. Going out of bounds. But we'll let Joey get some yards. And he's tackled after five yards. Okay. Now he tries we to got. buy some time. There he is. Touchdown. And that's Alex Brown. Bringing around town, and he has another receiving TD in his game, and we have Eclipse the seventy-point mark. Setting up the play action, he flings got it. A pass. Incomplete pass. That's incomplete, and the game is over. Thankfully. Big Mac won't, big <laughs> he won't run up his passing yards on us no more. Well, it's a tough day for his 427. Team. Individual performance, but you, know, you think about the team first, obviously, Bruh. this star player, and he cannot be happy with How we get lit up by Big Mac, but CJ Stroud couldn't do anything. That, does, that makes no sense at all. Hashtag Fire Ryan Day. <laughs> But we get the W. We score 71 points, but we give up 47. I don't. Uh, I'm happy about 
the performance on the offensive side, but I'm very disappointed about the defense. I feel like we're getting worse. And I already know my defense is going <laughs> to get talked about. You need a new playbook. You need new formations. You need to sub in and out. <laughs> Bruh, I promise you that it's not going to help. <laughs> the guys on the bench aren't better than the guys <laughs> on the field. <laughs> this is what we got. All right, we got some player stats. Let's check out Andrew Peasley. He did have a good game this game. He went 15 to 17 for 235, four TDs, zero interceptions, completed 88% of his passes, and he was not sacked once. I like those stats from Andrew Peasley. All right, on the rushing side of things, we got Titus leading away with 134 yards on 19 attempts. He also had four TDs. Andrew Peasley also had a TD on the ground to go with 122 yards on 13 attempts. We got Trayton Wutch leading away in receiving with 95 yards on five receptions and two TDs. We also got Alex Brown with four receptions and 87 yards. Also had two TDs. On the defensive side, we got Easton Gibbs leading away with nine solo tackles. He also had a TFL and an interception. Miles Williams also had nine solo tackles. Devon Harris had three TFLs and a sack. We did have several different guys getting TFLs. If you look here at the screen as I'm going down, not gonna name every last single one of these guys, but TFLs to go all around. We do have some stats as far as kick returns. Tyrese Grant had three kick returns for 151 yards and a TD. Yes sir, that boy had to kick six with 95 yards. If you will, take a look at the recruiting board. We are doing good as far as Steven Rogers. Yeah, we're doing okay. Looks like we might lock him up in the next couple of weeks. Hopefully, doesn't look like anybody's in competition with us. Hopefully it stays that way because this guy right here is a game changer. I would like to get this halfback Jonathan Jackson as well. I feel like he'll do good in the backfield. Uh, the rest of these guys we're either gaining on or we are in the lead on. Hopefully we can keep it that way. Have this outside linebacker that I would like to get. We do have another linebacker in here that we're losing on. Hopefully I can put some more points on them. Try to close the gap. But it is what it is, man. It, we're going to get some of these guys and we're not going to get some of these guys. Y'all know what the deal is. All right. If you'll take a look at the top 25, we have Alabama who is currently sitting at number one. We got Clemson at two. We got Michigan at three. We got Oklahoma at four. We got Baylor at five. We got Oklahoma State at six. We got Georgia at seven. We got A&M sitting at eight. They dropped from four to eight after they lose to Alabama. We got NC State at nine. And we got USC sitting at 10. I know I am going faster than the screen shows. But this is what happens when you have to do post commentary. I don't know how I was doing it before, so we just going along. <laughs> but we're going to scroll on down and we'll see the rest of the teams. And you will see that Wyoming is currently sitting at number 16. Moving up four spots after we get a win over BGSU. Yes, sir. Hopefully we can continue getting these W's and moving up the top 25 list. Hopefully. So how about them Cowboys? You know what I'm saying? We up in there, baby. Year one, three games into the season, we are currently number 16. Who would've thought? I know I didn't. But anyway, we'll finish out the top 25. We got Tennessee, Notre Dame, Utah, all rounding up the 17 through 19 spots. And then we have Ole Miss at 20, Penn State at 21, BYU is a new team in the top 25. Shout out to BYU. I see you doing what you do, even though you're one and one. Then we got Purdue at 23, Pittsburgh at 24, and who do we have at 25 this week? It's Arkansas. Let go, woo pig. All right, let's take a look at the conference standings. Air Force is currently sitting on top of the mountain side of the Mountain West Conference. They have played two conference games. 
two games in the division. We haven't played a single game yet, but we're sitting at number two. And no one has played a game on the west side of the Mountain West Conference. Okay, so let's take a look at the Heisman watch. I don't believe the two guys at the top should be in there. I really don't. Blake Corm, he should be in there. I feel like he's one of the best players in the country. Um, Tavian Thomas, I think he should be in there as well. And Nick Singleton, looks like he should be in there as well. All right, if you made it to this part of the episode, you already know how it go on this show. It's the outro. Yeah, how about them cowboys? We got us another win against a team here in week three. And I say another win because every win is a good win for the Wyoming Cowboys. We were not expected to be 3-0 right now, but we are 3-0. And that's all that matters. It don't matter how we do it, when we do it, where we do it as long as we keep doing it in the next episode we have air force on the schedule they are currently 3-0 and and we already know about the triple option offense so i hope that they don't run all over my defense i'm really hoping that they don't but i have a funny feeling that this probably was gonna happen can we score enough points to win this game i feel like we can because we beat ohio state and we beat Utah, two teams that are way better than Air Force. But their triple option offense is a different type of beast. Can we take them down? I believe that we can. But if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, that way you'll be notified the next time I drop a video just like this one. Also slide in that comment section, talk to your boy. You know we talk back over here. You know what I'm saying? And if you comment enough, you can get on that shout out list. And speaking of the shout out list, I got it right here. Shout out to Michelle Jackson, Product Visuals, Optimal Prime 870, Eric Rams, Warmaster 777, Thomas Bays, Dare, Matt Aarons, Arsenio Patillo, Dionne Patterson, Andrew Minton, Roscoe underscore 34, JK YouTube, Clips, The General, Equalcraft, Little Hair Guy, Slapshark23, Tim Alvarez, Tony Hawkins, Caleb Harper, Jordan Barker, Afro Magic, Smoking Night 609, Ethan Marlowe, Aaron Meyer, Aaron Kaufman, Cameron Hewlett, Quan D, and Matthew Dillard. And like I say in every episode, man, I appreciate every last single one of you guys for doing the things that you do. Keeps me going, man. Keep showing up to the live chat. Keep hopping in the comment section, keep hitting that like button, and I will keep dropping these videos. Yes, sir. But I am your HC. This is the Coaching Carousel series. We're in season one. We're 3-0, oh, trying to go to 4-0. and oh. Can we do it? Let me know down in the comment section. But I ain't going to hold y'all up for too much longer. Until next time, I'm out.